What is up guys? How is it going today? Um, if you can't tell by the title, this video is like a one year special that I'm doing. Um, just talking about like my entire first year on YouTube, I guess. Um, also, I apologize for my face being red. I just walked my dog and it was really hot outside. But um, there's a couple things I wanted to cover in this video, specifically like what I've learned from this, why I started it, and just some of those questions that I get. Um, also, I always say like questions I get and I really don't get many questions. Like it's more just like my friends like asking me this stuff. Um, I just think it's cool to talk about. So um, I'll get into the first topic, which is uh, why I started the channel. And to understand this, you'll have to go back about an entire year, um, cause that's when I started. So it was like July last year and I was really bored and I didn't have a car at the time. And so I was stuck in my room all, all day and I have, I have a lot of editing stuff like like I have, I was into graphic design in the past, so like I have a lot of like computer like graphics and that kind of stuff. And I always thought video editing was cool, but I never had any videos to edit. And I was always hanging out with my friends at night because that was the only time I could go hang out with them since I didn't have a car. So I was like, well, why not combine these two? That way I could like have something to do during the day and you know integrate it into my like daily routine. So at first I started off like filming fun videos on my iPhone, which aren't even on the channel anymore. It was just us doing like stupid stuff. Um, and then I just wanted more content to create, like wanted to have more stuff to be able to make. So I started to film like collection videos where I would just show off like stuff that I had at my house um, because I thought the entire project of editing the video and getting it uploaded was way more fun than recording it all. So I just found stuff to like record over and it was pretty fun. Um, yeah, I would do like the most random things, like five things I use on an everyday basis. And it was like literally a water bottle or something. I think I still have the video somewhere. But um, it was just stupid stuff like that. So, you know, keep, you know, you keep going. I make a couple of these videos towards the end of July, early August. And then comes college. I head out to college. And at this point, um, I don't really have a big group of friends up there. I kind of just... Uh, you know, did my own thing for a little bit, but I was still into graphic design and this was kind of like a way I made money in college. Um, I would just do logos for people and like headers and stuff for Twitter and that kind of thing. So I was like, well, I like making the videos still, so let's find something to make them over. So I started making videos on that. Um, I, the entire time I changed like what I did on the videos, it was always like the reason behind it was just I wanted something to edit and upload. Um, just because I really thought it was cool. I've been watching YouTube since I was like 10 years old, so like 2010. Um, and yeah, I've been on it uh, long enough, and so I finally like decide to start making videos. So then we'll fast forward to, you know, I, I moved back home and I still want to make videos. It's still a hobby of mine. I would say this is like my main hobby. Like I don't even care about the numbers because I just truly enjoy like um, recording and editing that kind of stuff, like learning about the, uh, the field. So, you know, move forward a little bit, I'm back home. I'm hanging out with friends again, so I start making videos like this. Um, I vlogged a couple times, I'm not super good at it, and the camera I have, which I'll get into here in a minute, um, isn't super good for it. So after I moved back home, I decided I wanted to like step up like how my social media game looked, like all my Instagram pictures and how the videos looked, because it's still like my main hobby. So I invested in a camera, a Canon Rebel T7i, um, which is what I'm recording this on. And it came with like an 18 millimeter through 55 millimeter lens. Um, don't know if any of y'all care, but I'm about to buy a new lens, so I thought I'd put that out there. Um, so I started learning like, you know, how to take pictures and I'm still pretty bad at it, but I'm learning. And um, so I got this big DSLR camera, um, you know, one of the handheld ones that's about like this big. And, you know, I've had a real good time. I like to get use out of it. I use it about every day. Um, and I'm still learning like photography as well as videography. So I'm just having a real good time with it. Anyways, I moved back home. I got the, I saved up for the camera. I bought the camera. Um, I bought the car. I bought the camera before I bought a new car, which is kind of, kind of bad because like the camera was still like, you know, like pursue my hobby and the car was actually like a mode of transportation. But anyway, so I got the camera and now I am doing pretty solid, um, like in life, I guess you could say. And so now I just have a lot more time to put towards this. Even though I don't have like a lot of time, this is what I like to do in my free time. Um, like for example right now I just got off work and I decided to film something um, before my entire family gets home and we go out to dinner. So um, that's one of the things I wanted to talk about. Um, through the past year I've been able to look at my analytics on YouTube which is pretty cool to like see myself grow even though I don't feel like I'm getting a fan base at all at this point. 
um, it's still just friends, but like the peak for each, like, I guess like spurt I have of like a lot of views to me, it just keeps going higher and higher. Like in the beginning, um, the little peak, like on my analytics was like 30 views and I couldn't get above 30 views, um, at all. Like that was like, wow, I got 30 views today. And now it's like a, on a daily basis, I get between like 20 to like 35, I think something like that. Still not big, but now like a big day to me is like 200. Um, that's been my biggest. So like, you know, if I have like 80 views in one day, that's like a pretty solid day to me. Um, it's been really cool to see my growth on that. And honestly, I just wanted to make this video to like thank everyone that's watched over the past year. Um, I'm at about 100 hours of watch time, which is about like I think 6,000 minutes. Um, and it's just kind of crazy to think that like that many people have watched me for that amount of time. And even though it's like so small, it's still crazy to think that like I am actually like on people's screens like being watched. Um, I also say um a lot. I don't talk about that at all, but I'm about to say it right now. Um, yeah, I really need to get good at it. When I first started doing this thing, I was really bad at talking to the camera and I still think I am. I'm real nervous around it when other people are around and this takes like a lot of me to do, but yeah, so I, I want to get better at that. Um, but like I was saying, I just want to, uh, I just think it's insane to see all the growth that I have had, even though I'm still so small. And if I keep at this, I can't imagine to think of how big I'll be able to get, um, just from the consistency of like uploading and that kind of stuff and increasing the quality of my content. Cause that's a really big thing online is staying consistent and just doing stuff on a regular basis. So I've learned that some from some of my friends that are like, that make music. I've talked about them before. Um, Jared and Dylan, they, uh, they make beats and stuff. They're like my, my friends that have stuck by me on this, like in real life. Um, so big, big thanks to them. A lot of people that I know, like personally are always kind of like, Oh, that's kind of stupid and all this. But I mean, at the end of the day, like this is really just a hobby I have. And no matter, no matter what I've done, um, they've stuck around and, they've been real helpful and they'll help me film and take pictures and I really owe a lot to them. Um, I also owe a lot to Colby who uh, is one of my friends that does this stuff with me but um, me and him are growing online like on our socials which is going really good. So so yeah like I'm just doing really good right now and I wanted to make like a one year video. Um, my one year isn't for like another week but I want to like take a lot of time to upload this because I want it to be the best the best video I've made yet. So. Other than that, I mean, like, if you enjoyed this video, um, I don't, I'm not even going to plug myself at this point, to be honest with you. Just thanks for watching, and I, I hope you all stick around, and just let me know any feedback down in the comments below, because um, I've had a great first year, and I can't wait for the next. Um, I've got some pretty cool stories that I'd like to share throughout the next year, um, from, like, my life, like, my childhood, and just, like, learning stuff from YouTube in general. So I'd like to share those. And this is just another one of my talking videos because I, I don't know, I just enjoy making these. Um, but other than that, I really did hope you enjoyed it. And be sure to like, I guess, tell your, tell your friends if you think like my channel is good. I don't, I don't really think my qual the quality of my videos is that good, but um, I enjoy making them. So that's all that really matters. I just need to know what people want to see so I can, so I can make more of it. Um, but other than that, I hope you all have a good day and enjoyed. And I'm looking forward to the next year.